To get us started, we need to reiterate the importance of always following the manufacturer's recommended installation instructions to help avoid any warranty issues down the road. As with all of our video instructions, we recommend that you view the basic functionality video to gain a thorough understanding of the best way to use our product. Taking a few minutes to review the basics will help ensure a proper installation, taking less time and providing a very high level of success. Because it is one of the most important parts of our design, we're going to show what we mean when we recommend leveling and plumbing the opening before the unit goes in. For double hung units, you may want to rip off the jam side fastening flange to prevent a void under the vertical jam leg of the unit. The base can now be fastened so that it will not move for the rest of the installation. After you've fastened the base wedge to the rough framing, you just need to insert the male wedge on each side, set the level, and pull them until the unit is level. Once you have the male wedge level, you fasten through so that it cannot move. Once the sill has been leveled, we can then move on to plumbing one side of the opening using the same process that we used on the sill. We'll pull the male up the incline until we get our side jam perfectly plumb. Here again, the same as we did on the sill, we fasten through both items, locking that shim set perfectly plumb. Of course, the size of the unit is going to determine how many people it is going to take to place it in the opening. In this case, one person is all that will be necessary. Because the sill and jam have already been fixed to the desired level and plumb, it is only necessary to place the unit on the sill shims and slide it over to the jam that has already been plumbed. Depending upon the manufacturer's instructions, you only need to tack the unit in place and finish shimming the other side jam. This can be completed in a variety of ways depending upon the instructions and the installer's preference. The shim assemblies could be fastened to the jam prior to the unit going in and left to be adjusted. Or the entire shim assembly can be inserted in an open side and fastened to the edge of the dimension lumber by taking advantage of the 90 degree living hinge on the end.